Hi there, in this video series, I'm gonna show you how to use all of Elementor's free widget elements. It's the number one page builder for WordPress in the world, and you can get it by going to dualfox.com forward slash Elementor. There you'll be able to download the free Elementor plugin. It's gonna let you build a beautiful WordPress website, and I'm gonna show you exactly how. So please do like the videos, subscribe to the channel, and now without any further ado, let's get straight to it and dive on in. Okay, in this video, we're gonna be having a look at Elementor's shortcode widget. So what is shortcode? Why do we use it? How do we use it? Why do you wanna use shortcode in WordPress? Uh, simple answer, it makes inputting information into your website really easy. But instead of explaining it or telling it, I'm just gonna show you how to do it. So first things first, let's say that you wanna have a contact form in the page. Obviously, Elementor has its own contact form widget, but for this, I'm gonna put one in using shortcode, as that's something that people are probably gonna to want to do. So exit the dashboard. There is absolutely loads of things that you get shortcode for, by the way, but contact forms are quite a common one that you're probably gonna come across if you're starting out. So let's just show you that. I go to plugins, add new, Come over here and I search for WP Forms, one of the very best form builders that's completely free. I go install now, and then I click activate. Now if you never use WP Forms and you wanna know how, they have their own video there, which you can just do. For now though, I'm gonna go straight to create first form. We can create blank forms and all the rest of it, but this isn't a tutorial about WP Forms, so I'm just gonna go and create a simple contact form. And then we could obviously add things in here, this is where you basically create your contact form, make it look good. I'll do a separate tutorial on exactly how to actually use all of this. But for now, let's say we've designed it, and what we wanna do is embed it into our page. So up here, we've got the embed button, and this is our shortcode. So it says, you're almost done. To embed this form on your site, please paste the following shortcode inside a post or page. You will get this with a lot of different plugins. Okay, not just contact forms, this is a lot of different things you will get shortcode for. You're gonna come across it when you're building WordPress websites. So what we wanna do is copy this, click close, click save, and then we're gonna close this down, head on back up to pages, go to the page I was just on, back to edit with Elementor, and then up here in the uh, widgets toolbar, you can either head on down to the general section, just down here, and that's where you're gonna find short code somewhere, or I'm just gonna search for it up here. There it is, click and drag, bring it on into the page, and it just looks like this. So it looks a little bit weird, but this is where we paste in our code, and lo and behold, that has immediately appeared on the page. Now, the reason you want to do this is because, if I close this down again, you can actually do this with the text editor, and I think a lot of people try to do this, and they think it's going wrong. So if you put in a text editor, if I get rid of this text, I can paste in my code here, and it looks like this. And I think this is where people seem to think that it's gone wrong. Now, technically it hasn't, because if I update this and we actually preview the page, it will work. There it is. So it looks exactly the same, it looks fine, it'll work fine, we can, we can fill this in. However, that's the beauty of using shortcode, because instead of it looking like this, it's actually gonna look uh, as you've designed it straight from the get-go. So paste your shortcode in here and immediately you see what you're working with. And again, if I update and we preview the changes, there we go. There's our contact form. So whatever it is that you're doing, wherever you're getting this shortcode from, that's how you use it with Elementor, just that shortcode widget. Go into your plugin, find wherever it is saying embed this code, okay? I obviously don't know what plugin it is that you're using or what you're trying to do, and if you've got any questions, please post them on in the comments, uh, but just go to that plugin, find that embed code, copy it, and that is what you are copying and pasting just here into our shortcode widget. Hope that all makes sense. As I said, do post any questions, please like the video, subscribe, and stick around to watch the next video in this playlist where we're learning everything there is to know about Elementor, the best page builder for WordPress. Yeah.